Good morning, sunshine, and welcome to Combo and Innocent Coffee. My name is Aiden, and this is the biggest Star Wars fan I know, my lovely fiance Maddie. Yeah. We are going to watch the Rogue One trailer that came out yesterday. We're sorry we didn't do one of these things yesterday, but you know. We already had filmed it. We totally forgot that they were going to make a video. Yeah, we're sorry. I mean, okay, but so a full day late isn't that bad. Nah. We've been way worse. We have been way yeah. worse. So this is, I don't know everything about this trailer. So we're going to watch it watch and it say once. some stuff about it. And maybe it's like a trailer breakdown. Maybe it's like a trailer reacts. Maybe it's like a, a thing. We haven't figured it out yet. We'll no. just see. Well, you're gonna find out though. Let's do this. With us. Ready? Set. Go. Do you poke yourself in the eye with the microphone? Yeah. Is that what you do when I'm talking? When you're not, uh, usually I'm making some hand movements. I you just, are. You just yeah, kind of like. I just do stuff. All right. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I understand. You like Will Ferrell in Talladega Nights. I don't know where to put my hands. No, I know exactly where to put them. They just. In your Fine. eyeballs. Go. All right, ready? Go. All right, pause. Following preview has been approved for appropriate audiences by the Motion Picture Association of America. Of America Inc. Inc. Thank you. So. Wow, that's some deep shit right there. Blue is for kids. Red, green is for normal. Is that really, really? I think so. I think blue is. I didn't know that there was. I always thought it was green. Cause, but like you can get a red band trailer and that's what rated R trailers. Yeah, but I mean, I've never seen it. Oh, because blue. it has to be approved? Yeah. But like, I feel like if you watch like a Baby Einstein trailer, it'd be blue. All right, I don't know. We'll have to look um, that up. Okay, I've Star never Wars. Known that. Okay, State so your name for the record. Jin Asa. Okay, so what is her name? Jin Forgery. Asa. Not the worst name in Star Wars. No. Is it the best name in Star Wars? No. Probably not. But maybe not. it could become. The best name in Star Wars. You know? Yeah. Okay. Because honestly, when I heard Ray the first time, I wasn't like jumping up and down with excitement. No. And now I think it's like, oh, that she's Ray. That's perfect. That's perfect. No, I agree. She couldn't be any other name. No, for sure. This appears to be Yavin 4, I would assume. I assume. I've always liked those helmets. Those helmets are pretty good. They're just a helmet with like a piece yeah. of plastic on the yeah. back. Yeah. No, oh, so nice. Uh huh. And that, the little, you know, the dumpster thingy that yeah. is always in is uh, clearly a man with legs. Is, yeah. is definitely has legs. And like, I, like I appreciate it. that. Yeah, yeah like, they're, they're like doing it. it. Yeah, yeah, Imperial documents. Them. Possession of stolen Wish property. Aggravated assault. Resisting arrest. Okay, so she's done some bad stuff. On your own from the age of fifteen. So that's Mon Moth. Aggressive. Which is so cool. Yeah, she's so cool. She's this in Return of the Jedi, and it? they haven't made her out of CGI. That's actually the person that played her. She has a cameo in a deleted scene from Revenge of the Sith. And they just use that? They use that actress. So there's she's like a lookalike to the original. Oh, so, so it's even, so it's it's not her. Is that the actress? It's not the actress from Return of the Jedi, it's the actress from Revenge of the Sith. Wow. Yeah, kind of odd. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. I mean, they look exactly the they same. They do, right? I was very impressed. I'm very impressed. Yes. Because I thought they just did the... CGI. Yeah, but I mean, who... Paul Walker. No. Other guy. Michael Douglas. No, he killed himself and he's in The Hunger Games. Philip Seymour Hoffman. Yes, that one, The Hoffman. I'm fucking really good. All yeah. Right. So she's kicking ass. Guys up. I rebel. She rebels. Okay, so she's in some sort of spaceship point. going somewhere. A major weapon. This, 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 this shot is bad. Really cool. need to know what it is and how to destroy it. Putting the build the Death Star. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Sarcasm. I sarcasm, felt a little bit yeah. sarcasm there. Okay, so this guy with the mustache. With the mustache. Um, is Diego Luna is the actor. Okay. And people are saying there's some rumors on the internet that he is playing Big Star Platter. Oh really? Yeah, who is Luke's friend from A New Hope who dies when they attack the Death Star. So he, spoilers. Spoilers, he's gonna die then. Well, I mean eventually, but we don't know that he's Big Star Platter. Because yeah. In the, the there's there's something that his name it, like casting release or something that his name isn't that isn't big star fighter 
But I think it'd be pretty cool. If and he's got the same stash. I really just, I don't know, just all the costumes yeah. and everything coming back. Is it's pretty, pretty cool. cool. Um, I don't know that the timing lines up though, because they, this is supposed to be five years, I think, before A New Hope. Yeah, so then... It, um, and he, he, in a deleted scene from A New Hope, Big Star Collider comes back and he talks to Luke on when he's joining the Rebellion. And I think it's not far after... After that. Luke meets Ben. Or not far after, before Luke meets Ben and stuff like that. So, it's probably not bad. Big Star Collider, but it'd be cool Stop. to watch him. Okay. Who is he? That guy, I, when I first time watched it, I was like, oh, there's Hannibal, or, you know, Mads Mikkelsen's character. You whatever. thought that was... I did, because I'm blind. Okay. And stuff, but it's not. Mm -hmm. That's not who it is. I can't is remember. Is Mads Mikkelsen in this movie? He is. That's cool. They um, have so many people. Like, yeah. that's so cool. Yeah. The first um, numbers, that's just a bunch of actors that they found. Mm -hmm. I believe that they're saying that Mads Mikkelsen is the designer of the Death Star. I think that's the rumor on the street. Okay. And that's that cool. he is also, simultaneously, um... What is her name? Jin Akra or whatever. Uh, Felicity Jones's character's father. And that's why the rebellion has round rounded her up. Because Wait, what? Felicity Jones? I'm getting so confused. Yeah, the, the main girl. Oh, okay, what sorry. Is Jin? It, yeah, yeah, I was like, you started using actors I did, and... Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, that's why they rounded her up so that he can, you know, they can go, she can go talk to her dad and be like, hey, dad, some Death Star Stop plans. this. This yeah. is really dumb. They're going to blow Who up is he? This, is, this was my question, but okay, so I think to go off on he, I can't remember the actor's name. I apologize. He, I don't care. I'm assuming going to be the Grand Moff Tarkin-esque character. Um, there was some thought that they were going to CGI in Grand Moff Tarkin. They probably will do that just for a minute. It's for fun. Yeah, just for fun. Um, but I think he's going to be big bad. That's my assumption. Okay. Um, is Darth Vader going to make a little cameo? I would assume... I, I read some things on the internet, people saying that they can hear his voice during this trailer. I okay. can't. Well, I haven't looked. Well, we've watched it once. I've watched it like 30 times. <laughs> You're an asshole. <laughs> I watched it with you first. What will you do when they catch you? The blood mask is up. Well, you yes. do break you. Wait, this guy's blind. He's blind? Uh huh. Okay, I'm sorry, I missed it. Yes. There's something blowing up. Yeah. But, um, why is he on Samurai? Is he like no. a lost Jedi? Like, you know, because they're not Maybe. really around anymore? Yeah. They've said that there's not going to be any Jedi in this movie. Okay, so that's what happened. Yeah. There's not going to be a Jedi, so, so they, they have to put a Samurai yeah, in. Yeah, they're like, here is this Asian guy that knows Kung Fu, and we're going to give him a stick, and he's going to beat yeah, up Yeah, and he's going to really look like he could use a lightsaber, yeah, but he doesn't Yeah, and he's going to be blind. That, he'll, here's my prediction. He'll be Force-sensitive, but not a Jedi. Okay. Sort of Maz Kanata-esque. Okay. Um, and then... Yeah. So there's that dude in white. If you continue to fight... Yeah. Um, we missed a scene where there is a dude. The AT-ATs are really the cool. The AT-ATs are really, really cool. Where there's the guy in the black cloak and he kneels in front of a big white cylinder. There's a picture of right there. Okay, but question. This is kind of like, you love history. It's I World War II-esque. It now, is super beach. World War II-esque. Yeah. That is totally It looks yeah. really cool. I completely agree. D-Day. What is that? It's not D-Day. It's, it's the one in Japan. Um, yeah, but what is the beach rate? I cannot remember. We're the worst. Stop poking her eyes. I'm sorry. She has cookies and it's not her fault. No, she, one of them had leaked under her nose. No. Yeah, oh, sorry. Um, okay, but so the thing that you can see right here, which is a, the, the, there's a dude in a black cloak kneeling in front of a big white cylinder and two red Imperial guards on either side. We, I don't know who the dude in the black cloak is. People say Darth Vader, but it doesn't look like he's wearing a helmet. Yeah. Um, Which is weird. He needs a helmet to breathe. Mm -hmm. And because the Imperial Guards are in the room, it's probable that whoever is in that white cylinder is the Emperor. Okay. And maybe he's in some... It looks like a bat to tank. Okay. Um, so I don't know who the dude in the black is. Maybe he's the secret big bad guy. And okay. the dude in the white cloak is the Grand Moff Tarkin, and the dude in the black cloak is going to be this... The big bat. The big bat. What will you become? Uh, and there's the big okay, yeah. cloak. Her wearing... What will you will you become? Stop become. Alright, yeah. Wearing the wrong colors. 
you know? Yeah. She's kind of on the wrong side right now. Yeah, she is. Is she undercover or is this before? Like, is it before where, you know, people used, oh. thought Finn was undercover, but it was actually he was the stormtrooper. Actually, he was started out as a stormtrooper. That's a good point. Is this her and that's why her dad? But I mean, she's kind of like, oh, I don't know. I mean, it is her dad. She would have it a pretty her. good job, high paying job. That's true. So let's say her dad is the Death Star person and he says, hey, she says, hey, dad, you know, I've fixed my shit around. I'm going to come and I want to work for you guys. And he's like, all right, that's great. He gets her a job. But why, why is she, she not the fixed around? Oh, she's faking that she, she's fixed around? Like, I think that, yeah, she's, she goes and says, hey, dad, look, I'm... I'm going to be good now? Yeah, I'm going to be good now. Oh, uh, I think, like... Not I guess it'd be in. kind of dumb if she started off here, like Finn started off. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's but, uh, but it just says that it, before in the trailer, she, Mon Mothma says like you haven't been home since age of fifteen. Oh yeah. Causing problems. Well, maybe this is as close as they can get her to look at fifteen. <laughs> That's. You know what? She does look a little bit younger. I'll give you yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> maybe she's fifteen in this spot. Yeah. So it's a flashback. Yeah, so she's so she's clearly got the imperial signal, sig, sig, what did I use? Sigil, sigil on her arm, um, and then she's got kind of like a, like a almost like a tie pilot outfit. It on her almost chest. seems like it. It definitely has buttons. Yeah, and then I don't, I can't tell. Those almost look like the traitor things. They do. They look or like they look more like escrow sticks than guns. Yeah, they they don't look like guns. And we don't. I don't Are they saber kind of things? Because they they look like they could. They laser could maybe shit. possibly be laser shit. Not I don't. They, they said no Jedi's in this movie. That does not mean that no there's no sense. lightsabers. Yeah, that's true. Right. I mean, we gave this. We know there's a sin because there's Darth Vader and probably the Emperor. Probably the Emperor and whoever that dude in the black cloak is. Right. Yeah. I don't know. I'm super fucking excited. I think it's a fantastic trailer. Yeah. And then. You know, I mean, definitely not as good as Force Awakens. No. All oh, that's left is you know, fancy Rogue One. I enjoy that they did Rogue One. The a Star Wars story. story. Yeah. It kind of makes it feel like, okay, look at... It's it's different. We're it's making a movie, same. you know what I mean? Yeah, this is... They just have so much free range when it comes to... These anthology franchise movies. movies. I agree. Yeah. And so they can just pick everything. I mean, yeah. they have to stick to canon stuff. And For sure. Like that. I like the idea that they're going to just have this movie where it's like, okay, well, here's Felicity Jones, here's Forrest Whitaker, here's all these other guys, we're going to get them in a group, and they're going to go do a thing, and the movie's going to be over. Yeah, and then... And Maybe we see him again, maybe we don't. But there was that one movie where they were there. Well, it's not going to change the course of anything. That's that's no. what's kind of cool about it. It's, it's just like, here's a movie. Yeah. Which yeah. I, I really like that. I'm really yeah. excited about it. I'm excited, too. Yeah. I'm, yeah. Now All I right. want to watch the Daisy Ridley exclusive Q&A. Oh. Yeah, me too. Yeah, what is this? Uh oh, are we going down to that? Force Awakens moments, the best. Yeah. We got that BB-8 with the little light. That's definitely that was, up there. That was yeah. a pretty good moment. All right. Yeah. All right, thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe to our channel, and all that wonderful, happy, fun stuff. And if you haven't watched this trailer yet, please, you know, go, it's just, it's everywhere. You, you can, it's really everywhere. I like it. how we were like waiting for it to come out, and by the time, like, time yeah. it loaded, 400,000 views. Views, and we're like, whoa! And it has, <laughs> that happened. Was it, Eight million? it has almost nine million now. A lot. Yeah, it's everywhere. Yep. Just Google Star Wars, it'll be there. I know, for yeah. sure. Alright, peace out. Bitches.